like trembling in his boots at the thought of tangling with his mom again. I'm like Crowley. I'm like Crowley. Crowley's dead. <laughs> but Crowley is never dead. Oh, Crowley's dead. Back. Oh, Crowley's dead. I know he's dead. Well, you'll see. I'll ask Jeremy. It's all good, though. <laughs> well, if he were to suddenly find a miraculous way back to the life of See, now you're making me write your fan fiction for you. This is terrible. Absolutely. It's the laziest group of people I've ever met in my entire life. Absolutely. Seriously. How could that be lazy? Just met this and did this, then what would happen? It's like, write it yourself. That's <laughs> the so way we do it. I sold that from a really good writer. <laughs> say what would be your fan fiction story if you oh go it. away <laughs> you write it we were just so talking. no more questions no. we're good then right <laughs> we were just talking to Misha about how far oh, well, that doesn't count how far <laughs> how far ahead you guys know where things are going and they give you kind of a basic outline of where your character's gonna go I'm dead <laughs> if you weren't dead if I wasn't again you want me to write fan fiction yes. I have a feeling Do if it. you were truly dead you wouldn't be here right now no I'd be here anyway you know that I've been coming here 17 years I've been on the show 17 years I'd be here anyway they just took pity on me and wanted me to show up we'll see do you have any ideas about what the darkness is do you have any ideas what dead? the darkness is yeah pre-biblical force yeah the darkness Sort of before the in the beginning was yes. in the beginning what, before what the in the beginning was the darkness. What's what? It contain? Was it contain? Yeah, what does it contain? What does the darkness contain? Yes. Darkness. <laughs> <laughs> so you can't see. You're blind. Is that, so you're extrapolating that answer from that response. <laughs> Very good. Cool. Yeah, Gotta do all is, your work like for you. People are terrible. When you come walking by, say hell no. We're not sharing nothing with you. <laughs> so argumentative. <laughs> So, so any real want, questions? Well, do you want to share anything with us? Is there anything that you oh, know, like, now you can say? Oh, now I've got to write, write the questions for you as well. <laughs> this is, this is the, 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 the worst group of journalists <laughs> I've ever met in my life. So, hmm, let's see. Anything you want to say to us? <laughs> so what was your favorite part of playing the whole Crowley and his mother relationship in season 10? My favorite part? Apologizing to my mother for, for um, every time the show aired, the fact that I didn't feel that way about my mother. So it was kind of call my mom today. really honestly I love my mom it's good but what was it like working with Ruth Connell then she's fabulous fabulous actress she's a bit kind of a wild spirit in her own way part of a what a wild spirit a wild spirit how would you ascertain that I interviewed her she made her a wild spirit <laughs> she's rather lovely actually yeah. <laughs> she's been a very very interesting character I sort of but it's over a year a, a thorn in my side it's a sort of it's an interesting thing I mean I knew what was going to happen always knew what was going to happen in the situation, but always knew where she was at. Crowley always knew what she was going to do. So. We'll see. <laughs>